welcome to my YouTube channel. I am Andrew and I'm so excited because today I'm going to be doing something that I'm really, really excited about and that's lipsticks. Yes, because I'm a very huge lipstick girl so I'm going to be showing some of my personal favorites. Uh, lipsticks, my go-to whenever I want to buy lipstick, the brand and the color, some of my favorites and you can also share with me your favorite lipsticks. You can comment and tell me what are your favorite lipsticks and what of mine that you like. So let's get started. I'm actually going to be doing a lip uh, a lip swatch, sorry, and a hand swatch for you guys to see what it looks like on the skin complexion and actually what it looks like on the face. So I have like eight lipsticks. So let's get started. It's going to be fun. So the first lipstick I'm going to be talking about is actually the Nuba number 7 and it's actually over. <laughs> and they recently hiked their price, it's like 2000 for this. But it actually stays for so long because this one was bought in February so it really really stays for long. And it's actually what I have on. I really really love this color because it's a really bright red as you can see. And it how it looks here it's such a bright beautiful red and it stays on the whole day it's matte that means it can be a bit dry but i like the drying effect and i'm definitely going to buy myself another one of this because it's a must have when you want a pop of red and you want to look so beautiful and so uber glam this is definitely the lipstick you should go for it's amazing <laughs> as you can tell so Number seven. That's my first favorite lipstick. So I've actually taken off the Nuba, so and we're gonna do the second one, which is not a lipstick per se, but it's a lip gloss. It's Max Mineralize Glass Sheer Coincidence. I actually got it as a gift when Max Store was launching in Kenya, and I really like it because when I do not want to have a lot of stuff going on on my lips, this is what I do apply. I'm gonna do a swatch for you. Beeps. Um, can you see? This is what... Give me a second. I don't even know why I'm holding my mirror. It looks something like this. Um, did you see? It's the second one. The first one was the Nuba and now this is the lip gloss. Uh, Max Smith lip gloss. I really like it because it's such a beautiful, softish, pinkish, peachish. Is this peach or pink? I think it's peach. Right? Alright, let me just show you how it looks on thine lips. Diva is one of the most beautiful brown lipsticks that I have ever had and I am in love with this lipstick so this is how it is the third the third third swatch right there from your left or right I'm not sure it's like the third here I'm not good with right and left so that's how it goes so I'm just gonna apply it on my lips for you guys to see how this beautiful color looks like. So yeah, that's how MAC Deepa looks like. And isn't it just the most beautiful brown color you have ever seen in your whole life? Like, I am literally in love with this color it is so beautiful it's not too much it's not too crazy guys get yourself mac diva if you're a diva sorry no just get yourself diva this is literally one of the, my absolute favorite lipsticks so 
fourth lipstick now and this is Revlon Crimson number 29. This is actually my friend's and my friend's Esther's and I really really like it and I told her I have to talk about it because it's, I'm, I'm definitely going to be getting myself one of it because it's really beautiful. It's also like a brown. I feel like it's almost like diva. Only that it's a bit more brown. And you're going to hear my, my goddaughter crying in the background. <laughs> But yeah, this is, um, what is it? It's like a browner shade of it, and it's really, really just so beautiful. So let me just apply it for you guys. Revlon. I almost say MAC because I have a lot of MAC. This is how Revlon by MAC, uh, Revlon by MAC again. This is how Revlon looks like. It's such a beautiful brown as you can tell. And I feel like everybody needs to get themselves one of this. I'm definitely going to get it. Um, my friend has talked so much about it and I'm definitely going to get myself. This is how it looks like. And this is how it looks like. So Revlon, definitely I'm going to get myself one of this. Or Esther is going to get me. Lipstick number five, and that is none other than MAC Russian Red. Yeah, lipstick number five. Sorry for that weird intro. Anyway, yeah, this is MAC Russian. Feels like it's Russia. You know? It's a bit Italian. No. I feel like that's a bit Italian. That's not Russian. Anyway, so yeah, this is actually a very other really red lipstick. I remember the reason why I bought this one is because. Where I was buying it, um, Ruby Woo was sold out, so I had to buy the other one, which was MAC Russian Red. Now, I'm not a really big fan of Russian Red because, um, so, sorry, that's how it looks, because it has, it lives, for me, after I wear it for so long, it has like a weird line that comes out and it's not, it's not pretty. So let me grab my mirror and show you just how it looks. But, um, otherwise, it's just a beautiful. Anyway, 
We're almost done with my favorite red lipsticks. Only two more to go and I'm not saving best for last, but okay. This is number 45 by uh, Muba. I first showed you number seven and this is Camila Pachi. This is number 45. It's like a purplish, uh, really beautiful. I'm, I know I've said that about all my lipsticks that they're actually beautiful, but I'm not kidding. This is again so beautiful and it has like a bit of shimmer to it and that's why I love it. Let me show you a lips, a hand swatch. A hand swatch, a hand swatch, a hand swatch. Sorry. This is the, the third one from your right. This is number 45. Like it? Like it? Let's see it on the lips. I told you guys this is no? Let me find a synonym for beautiful. This is amazing. This is beautiful. This is wonderful. All the synonyms of beautiful you can find. But this is number 35. Like, literally, did I say that this is the most amazingly beautiful purple color? And it has like a bit of shimmer, just like a small bit of shimmer, and it's so beautifully done and created. And this is just magnificent. Number 8. This is my eighth favorite lipstick. It's by Mac. And it's Ruby Woo. Ruby Woo. I know so many of you guys have heard about it. If you haven't heard about Ruby Woo, I don't know which hole you've been living in. This is a hand swatch. You can see how actually it looks like. It's to my right and it's to your left. Uh, you're watching, it's to your left. This is how it looks. It's, uh, MAC describes it as a bluish red color. And it's matte, it's retro matte. It's part of their retro matte collection. And it's a really, really amazing red color. I am. I am in awe of its beauty and it's personally one of my personal, personal favorite lipsticks. So I'm going to show you how it looks on my lips. As I said, I, I'm not big on lip liners, so I believe it will go well with the lip liner for you to just define your lips a bit better. But, this is so beautiful, it's an amazing and amazing colour. I think every every woman should have this. Honestly, I think everybody should have this. It's so amazing and it stays and it's matte and it's just everything you need in a lipstick. So definitely go get yourself one of this Ruby Woo lipstick. So yeah, that's it for Ruby Woo. Say bye-bye Ruby Woo. Say bye-bye. Okay. And so yes, those were my eight favorite lipsticks. I hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to tell me which of my favorites that you liked and also which are your favorites that you like. Also subscribe um, to my channel and share. And also you can follow me on Instagram at Manjuru Manjuru. Also on Twitter at Manjuru underscore Manjuru. Until next time guys, bye.